Come on in. Good morning and welcome to Trans West Truck Trailer RV. My name is Katie O'Neill and I am so excited about today's video. Uh, so to my clients that ordered this classic, thank you so much for allowing us to make this fantastic video. Again, my name is Katie O'Neill. You can find me at 303-562-8659. Again, 303-562-8659. And today we are looking at a 2023 Renegade Classic. This is a 45 CBF. This is a mid bath and rear bath bunk model with an extra bunk over cab. As you can see, I've got my insulated skylight here with giving me roof access. Um, so just a really exciting video from you. As usual, you can find us at TTTRV on YouTube, at RVs Inside Out on YouTube, and live five days a week, uh, three times a day with a horse trailer, a truck, and an RV video. And for me, I like to start everything from the inside out. So Jody, if you don't mind, take her on back. So please, as you're looking through this coach, note that we have the honey uh, finish here. So this is a beautiful wood interior, nice and light. Um, also the bison, and, uh, the bison decor as well. And then on top of that, we have our beautiful uh, Cortina, Pegasus Cortina, Pegasus tile flooring. Um, so absolutely lovely interior, very light, very open, very airy feeling. And this coach has just got so much room. Uh, it's just a fantastic uh, floor plan. So this is definitely one of our top selling floor plans, uh, giving you this full master bath in the back. You know, you just, you really have so much room um, in, the, in the shower and in the toilet area, there's so much storage. Um, of course, you know, when you see these uh, full tile uh, showers, this is an additional option, as is the uh, skylight over the shower in both of the mid and rear showers, um, as is the teak bench. So, of course, this is one of my favorite features that we'll have uh, in a Numar. And, of course, uh, you know, it's something I always recommend to everybody ordering any kind of Super C because to shave your legs, to wash your feet after a long day at the track great way to be able to sit down and be very comfortable but this is such a residential feel and renegade does such a nice solid surface undermount sink um, as you can see there's no edges here so this is just wonderful because it gives you such an easy cl uh, to clean surface and then look at the size of this medicine cabinet um, and now you know these are made in uh, elkhart indiana um, by a very large amish community and uh, there are so many people at Renegade that put so much time and effort into craftsmanship, but the solid cabinetry um, that you find in the classic is so robust, it's so sturdy. This is really a lifetime coach. And I just love really nice full extension drawers with dovetail finishes throughout the entire RV. Again, just a beautiful backsplash and lots and lots of room. Great place to keep your toothbrushes, maybe some dental floss. Just love that feature. Little plate. You can even keep your toothpaste in there. There's plenty of room. And then look at all of the storage underneath. It's just incredible. And again, these are all soft clothes, full extension drawers. And this is called Honey. Um, so one of the things that goes into, you know, ordering an RV like this is, you know, figuring out what it is that's most important to you. And for our clients, they really wanted some of these extra kitsch features. So as you look around this bedroom, you'll find this king bed with lots of overhead storage. You've got the rear window above the headboard. So you've got tons of light coming into the cabin. Uh, we also have power MCD shades uh, for the night shades and then there are manual day shades. One of the nice features about that is if you're looking to put all your shades down at night when you're going to bed, you just push a button and all of them come down. But you have the nice day shade so you can just pull them as you need to. And then look at this. I just love all of the storage that you have. Uh, one of the things I think is unique, um, there's different brands do different things well. One of the things that's unique about Renegade is that their compartments are fairly uniform in shape and size, so it's very easy to buy boxes to put in them. Um, now you'll see we have nightstands on both sides of the bed, as well as two 110 outlets, a USB-C and a USB port as well. 
But one of the best, I think, features of any of these Super C's that we sell, whether they be a Renegade or a Superstar uh, by Numar, is the ability to walk around the bed, all this room that you have in this bedroom. So both people can get in and out to use a restroom at night very easily. Lots and lots of uh, comfortable space here. And then I love, look at this beautiful cedar lined uh, wardrobe. And this goes all the way through behind this 43 inch Samsung TV. Of course, this is a smart TV, so you're gonna be able to uh, just use your uh, Netflix. And then here's my little hand down below. So you have full access the whole way through this beautiful cedar lined cabinet. I'm so excited uh, for this video. I know my clients have been dying to see the RV. And of course, it just takes a few days for us to get everything ready to rock and roll. Uh, for delivery so she's been in the shop going through her health check this did very very well um, and so this is the first time they'll be able to see this rv is on this live video which is so much fun and these clients were clients of mine from uh, my previous life at audi and they found me on a video and came in to see me and said i think we want a classic and uh, the p4 cascadia chassis was really important to them um, so many things. They've done so much research. They're such an intelligent, you know, fantastic couple to work with because they're really dedicated uh, to getting exactly what they want out of their coach. And what was really fun is, you know, things like the Allison versus the DD or versus the DT12 transmission. Which one's better? So, you know, off the line, I'd say the Allison has a bit of an advantage, but going up and over mountain passes or for any kind of heavy loads, you know, when you have so many more gears to choose from as opposed to six, you've got double that at 12 gears, you can really get the power that you need and the gear ratio that you need with so much more flexibility in this transmission. And so little things like that allowed, I think, um, for what is a very well thought out, very well researched, very functional coach, for their use, which is just so fun to be part of. Um, these are just beautifully like spacious uh, bunks and uh, they are 30 by 80. So really, really long, definitely good for an adult sized person. And there's televisions in the top and bottom. And you also are gonna see that you have your screens, your full windows that open, and then again, USB-C, USB two one ten outlets, lights for everybody above, and then three drawers down below for your storage. Now, of course, we've got the curtains. We've got the really nice built-in ladder, which doesn't protrude. So I have a Superstar, which is a bunk model. Uh, one thing I really like about this ladder is it's integrated. So it's being used as part of the furniture, so it doesn't hang off the side. You don't have to remove it and uh, unremove it to have access when the slides are closed. The other thing I really love about this coach is I love this full length mirror here because if you're in this room and you're deciding to use it as a dressing room, look at the, there's so much girth to this door. I really wish um, you could feel this and it's magnetic. So it just, it, lo it locks into place when the, the two are together and just slides into place. And of course there's that snap lock. Uh, Renegade does such a good job at consistency throughout their product. Um, but so if you're getting dressed in here, this is a really nice dressing room. Someone else can be sleeping in. Maybe you got up, took a shower. We were making coffee. Just so nice to be able to have all of this extra room in here. And when I say take a shower, you can take a shower here because this is not just a bath and a half model. This is a dual bath model, bunk model. So there's two sleeping uh, centers here in the mid, one in the back, and then there's a bunk over cab as well and a couch that converts. So you could really have the whole posse you know, in with you. And again, all of these um, features, so the skylight, the full tile shower, um, these are optional features. So when you go in to build your coach, you know, one of the things I would highly recommend, uh, which we certainly did with this RV, is go visit the factory, pick out the things that you want, take a look, you know, at what Renegade has to offer and make sure your RV is gonna be exactly what you need it to be for your family. And it really doesn't take all that much time. Um, and it's just got such a better outcome uh, because every single little nuance of this RV has been so well thought out um, and made specifically for the use of this vehicle. Look at all of that storage. Just love the way Renegade does everything. Um, and this is just such a nice feature. I mean, what would you give 
to have your RV going down the road where you have things like maybe, you know, your cotton swabs, your Q-tips, maybe some lotion out. You don't have to put away every time you get traveling because it's in this nice little spot that holds steady while you're going down the street. Um, now, of course, 600 horsepower, 1,850 foot-pounds of torque, a 30,000 pound towing capacity. As you can tell, this coach is definitely going to be used uh, for some heavy hauling. It will have uh, race cars uh, behind it and a nice trailer. Uh, there's a digital dash display with the brake controller that's already integrated. Um, we've got cameras, uh, we've got different camera systems for the side, for side cameras, the rear stacker. So there's actually four camera controls integrated into this coach. Um, and like I said, everything is very specifically done uh, for this client. The stackable washer and dryer, of course, just gives you better ability to go out longer on the road. Look at the size of this laundry drawer. I mean, honestly, I've got a little coach envy, I've got to tell you. Um, so my superstar, of course, is all white, just like this RV is. Um, but I definitely would say this is uh, giving me a good run for my money, especially with that big power and big towing capacity, 30,000 pounds, can you imagine? And even these are soft clothes, and they're just so deep. There's so much room in here. The wood is all so beautiful. Again, I talk a lot about how you can have a coffee pot and a rice cooker or an air fryer up here. I mean, this is really set up for very much residential living. Uh, this is just like having a second home. Um, I know for my clients, that's really what we kind of equated this to. This is really their second home. Uh, this is an all electric coach. Uh, so for a little bit extra, you can have a recessed uh, induction cooktop that has covers on it. Um, I do think that that's really, really useful. Uh, one thing that we had talked about when they came in to visit uh, just recently was buying something that has just a little bit thinner profile than the cover so that you can have a little bit of a lip so that when you take a tight turn, your phone has a place to rest. Um, but you've got your uh, induction, uh, your induction cooktop and then your convection and microwave oven. So no need for an undermount un oven, giving you tons of storage space. Look at all of this room. So just really nice, of course, and that's because there's, there's nothing underneath to take up that space. Um, one of the things that's really been uh, nice about Renegade is, so you have your integrated systems here that tell you about your power, but that kind of gives me a nice way I can segue in. I have all of these same systems available on my app through the Firefly app, so I can actually go in here and see all of the same notifications that I have here on my app as well. And we're even going to use this app to bring the slides in today, um, which is a really handy feature, maybe more so for uh, when you're parking then when you're departing, we'll use them for the form of the video today. Um, you'll see here, Renegade does this such, a, such a nice job labeling everything. It's so tidy. Um, it's so, you know, just well thought out and purposeful. And there's, again, so much storage in this kitchen. It's just really impressive. And little nuances like this, where you have your silverware drawer, as well as a drawer here for your cutlery down below. Just really, really nice uh, features there. Again, all those soft closed drawers. And I just really hope I can transport you into this coach where you can feel the girth, um, you know, and hear how solid this cabinetry is. Just really, really impressive. Uh, here's that app. So this is the Firefly app. Um, so we'll use um, this on almost all of our Renegade products. And it really has a strategic advantage in that it allows us to have great dexterity in arriving to campsites and getting parked where you need to. And then here we've got a full undermount stainless steel sink. Again, another little scrubby brush holder, a little bottle brush maybe. I use those little baby bottle brushes. Those are great to keep around just because the shape works so well. And then our subwoofer down below. So not only do we have uh, you know, great televisions throughout the coach with our 4K smart TVs. We also have a subwoofer and then this really nicely integrated sound bar that you can pair both to the movie or to your phone. So if you want to just listen to the radio, um, you can play your dash radio. If you want to listen to a playlist though, you play it right here through the center sound bar, either inside or outside. There's another one outside as well. 
Um, did we go up here yet? I don't think I got this upper cabinet. It's just incredible how much storage we really have in this coach. And then you've got an 18 cubic foot refrigerator down here in your Samsung, but above here you have your uh, Sony Blu-ray player. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put this ladder up. Uh, there are lots of little things to think about. So for instance, are you interested in having a 27 by 27 cutout uh, so that you have easier cab access uh, to the bunk? And for, uh, for the folks that ordered this coach, absolutely, it was a deciding, they really like to be able to move this out of the way so they could have better access if they weren't using the upwards bunk. Um, also, you know, you've got your three uh, 15,000 BTU air conditioner and heat pumps. Do you want to have them covered with mirror inserts? Yes, so all three of the heat pumps and air conditioners are decoratively covered, which is super nice. Um, do you need just one freezer or do you want one outside as well? Well, they would like to have one outside as well. So they've got both the ice maker and deep freezer inside as well as one on the outside of the coach. So super, super handy. Um, this is a great place to keep laptops, any kind of charging cords, things along those lines so that you have access to them while you're going down the road. But it, it, what, what's the use of having those if you can't charge them? So over here, down below your drink holders, which hold your drinks in place while you're in motion. So you again, take a tight turn. You've got your drink holders right here. You've got USB-C, uh, USB and two 110 outlets on both sides. So you could actually have two people working at this workstation. And then again, one of the most important features, as I mentioned earlier, is look at how consistent the size of the storage space is. So what's really nice is you buy those little shoe boxes, you know, from the container store, get your label maker out and go A through Z, whether you have a B for battery box or an F for flashlight or an O for outdoor cooking, you can have all of those things and really have a very nice, easy to find uh, space. And by doing it alphabetically, you're not hunting through and trying to remember where everything is. Um, so, you know, I think, uh, I think that this is, again, one of the attributes that's really important to understand uh, that differentiates, because different manufacturers do things different ways, but I really love the storage on the Renegade a lot. Um, I love our solid wood balances as well. As you can tell, this, this is a very nice, RV, there's uh, a few throw pillows here at your, at your booth. Um, I like the fact that we have a rubber band ball. No, that's, that's just for my booties. I had to make my own booties today. <laughs> no, great cup holders though. And then uh, the furniture is just so soft to the touch. It's, it's just beautiful. So we're gonna go ahead and bring these slides in right now. And then we'll move into the cab. And normally I bring the slides in while I'm outside, but it's cold. So I'm going to bring the slides in while I'm inside. And so we're just going to go ahead and do the rear slide first. So you just push and hold that retract button and you'll be able to see uh, all the room um, kind of suck in so you can see what kind of walking space you'll have through the coach. So there's that bed sliding in. Underneath that bed is 150 gallons of fresh water. There's two 75 gallon tanks. And then here we're going to go ahead and pull in the bunk slide. Look at how much room you have in this hallway. So this is again um, the Cortina Pegasus tile floor. I love this beautiful porcelain floor. But one of the attributes that's really positive about Renegade is going to be the amount of walking space that you have. So if you have a big dog um, or a bum knee or any kind of injury, and you'd like to be able to have more access to a full-size door, maybe you want to take a shower while you're traveling. You can do all of that in this RV. You can also do your laundry. Like I said, this is all electric. It does have a 12.5 uh, quiet diesel generator by Onan. It also has three lithium ion batteries and also it has three 200 watt solar panels. So that's new this year. We've gone from our traditional 175 watt solar panel up to 200 watts. So with all the lithium, all of the solar, and then the second 3000 watt inverter, we can actually operate an air conditioner unit here in the mid cab, uh, both while we're on the road or just track side. Again, this is gonna be a track 
a, a track motivated build. Um, and one of the things, so people talk about lithium a lot. Um, I really don't think it's useful in a number of applications, but for somebody who's going to be track side that may not have access to 50 amp and maybe in a hot environment, having 50 amp actually is um, really important for running air conditioners, or you can do a build like this where you have your lithium ion battery packs and your second inverter, which is going to give you access to having an air conditioning uh, system running without being plugged in. So in that application, no generator on, just running off a of battery power and solar, certainly that could be useful. Um, so I would like to go over the cab, but I think before we do, we're gonna go ahead and tour outside of the vehicle. Um, just so we can kind of make a nice graceful entrance into the doors in the front. Of course, this is a mid-entry coach. One of the benefits of buying a Super C isn't just safety from frontal impacts. Um, it's not just accessibility in terms of working on the engine. It's also having three different ports of entry into the coach. Uh, so as you can see, this is a very roomy entrance. It's very, very easy for someone, you know, to maybe be sitting down, reading a book, having a sandwich, you know, doing dishes, whatever it is while you're in route. But when you get there, if everyone wants to jump out, maybe it's someone's job to go to the, con you know, get the concessions and get, you know, some gum and somebody else's job is to do uh, the, the fuel on one side, the other person does the other side. You could really have all that teamwork because everybody's got their own port. So on our way out, we'll just note things like all of these great little courtesy lights that are, show everything as you go in and out of the coach. Your battery disconnect is here. Um, your entry step override is here, and then also your start boost, and then of course the fire extinguisher. Now we do have hard lights, um, so you can turn all of the masters off, all of them on, all from this central uh, feature. So I just turn all the lights off, which is so convenient. Um, but you could also just do that with your app. Um, of course, we are really big fans of the keyless entry pad here. The keyless entry pad, of course, allows you to not need uh, to have, um, as uh, not to need to have your key with you when you're when you're out on the track. You could just leave that inside the vehicle and then lock the doors. Uh, this here is your step cover, so very nicely made. Uh, this is just the little handle to lift it up, uh, so it's really nice. Renegades made a step cover. We also have uh, an upgraded, uh, nice. As you can see, this Rhino lining that you have on the inside as well as a little port that you can open. Another thing that Renegade does really well are these latches on their doors. So the extra latches make them super solid, super robust. And then of course our big TV. Oh gosh, I got it. Don't worry guys, I won't break it. Um, Samsung again, 43 inch 4K smart TV with again that sound bar. And also, as I mentioned earlier, you've got your easy glide tray with your Truma uh, with your Truma uh, freezer and refrigerator outside. And I'll just show you the inside of this as well. So big deep basin and then a little bit more shallow as well. Um, of course, we use Dometic with Numar and Truma with Renegade. But what an exciting, what an exciting RV just love the way that this has turned out. It's turned out so well. Um, and then you can see, so you've got your, uh, your lane tracking package. So these are actually going to be your sensors here. Uh, there's also side indicators, uh, turn signals on the side of the coach, which I think is really nice. They're mid coach. So if you're trying to get over in a lane, not only do you have your turn signals up here, you also have the mid coach as well. One of the things I think that Renegade does really well, I love this entrance. Uh oh, locked. We'll do it on the other side. Um, these are so sturdy. Um, it's just fantastic. Uh, you know, a great place to catch all the dirt before you get into the coach. And then again, this is that Cascadia P4 chassis. Uh, this is the DD16. So 605 horsepower, 1,850 foot pounds of torque. Just a beast. Again, with the DT12 transmission, um, really made for going down the road. I love the Voyager camera system throughout. Uh, just a really robust and um, attractive front end. Look at the size of this monster. You can see your little camera right up there. You can see for uh, both your, um, your distance uh, mitigated cruise control. And this coach will, if it thinks you're gonna crash, it's actually gonna help to apply the brakes and keep you safe. 
Uh, we have our upgraded uh, Zip-D dual awning system. So this was a big feature that they were really interested in having. We also have six additional lights on the exterior. So another nice feature, the AquaHot 450D. So this is a beast of a hydronic system, giving you not only your hot water, uh, but also providing furnace heat for you. So there's a tube of liquid. I call it aqua hot juice. Mention that you watch this video when you order your coach. I'll make sure you have an extra gallon. Uh, but this aqua hot juice gets heated up and runs through a tube underneath the coach, pushing air over the top of it is what warms your vehicle when you're too cold for heat pumps. So for instance, today's weather might just barely be keeping up with keeping the coach heated, but the diesel burner heat pump would do absolutely wonders in cold climates at keeping you nice and toasty. And look at all the extra room in this compartment. I mean, it's just really, really, it's fantastic. And again, this is an upgraded liner, but this liner is so nice because you can just wash those out um, so easily. Um, I love the look of these big, uh, big tires, these big rims. Of course, this is a twin screw, so this has got that extra traction. Um, so if you are pulling a heavy load, maybe it's a little snowy, a little slick out, you need that extra traction, you can engage both of these and have two forward facing or forward pulling rims um, as, well as, your, uh, as well as just your rear. So it's not like the tag axle you would find on a Class A. This is actually two rims that you can engage your second rim or your second axle. So it's creating traction, not just in snow either. It could be sand, it could be wet surfaces. If you're hauling a big boat, this could be the type of coach you might want. So if you're if you're a marina guy who's you know got a really nice luxury yacht, I know we have a gentleman who has an Essex as his camping vehicle, but he has a uh, Supreme Air to go back and forth between the marinas because between Florida and New York, it just needs something a little heavier haul. This would be a really good fit for that as well. Again, take a look at this huge bay inside. Of course, your air chalk will allow you to get to all, uh, all eight of your tires. These are the slide locks, and then this is the extra towing kit. And as mentioned, you can go ahead and just peer into that box, Jody. I didn't take it out because it's quite heavy. Um, but this is a beefy setup, really beefy setup. Uh, we've got, of course, our central vac. Uh, hoses are in the next compartment here uh, and then a few extra tiles this is a great bay it actually has a, again a place where if you rinsed it out it could drain but you could also run anything that you want um, out of this bay because you've got that little grommet down below that you can twist and remove and man oh man look at this talk about being ready to rock and roll I am so excited so I got a text message that said, we need water on board because we need this bad boy to be camp ready when we pick her up. I said, absolutely, no problem. We've got a 36 inch power cord back here. Again, the nice little removable grommet, you just take this out and you can run your uh, 50 amp through. Make sure you put this back on and, and seal it up tight whenever you're done camping. Um, these cords do tend to uh, drop as they go over bumps and uh, I think I dragged mine between here and Lyman. And we only wore off about 50% of the head, but <laughs> yeah, don't do that. Uh, again, here's your quick connect access. Another little small detail or extra feature. Um, very inexpensive to add, but could be very important for the way that you're camping. We talked about your 12.5 kilowatt uh, quiet own and diesel generator. I could turn that on my phone. I could also turn it on outside here. So if I didn't have my phone with me and I needed to get the gen running, really easy access here at this outdoor panel. Here's that bedroom slide. Here's your bathroom window. As you can see, that does open. I love this water bay. So it's so nice that everything is etched into uh, this material. So, you know, you instead of having to worry about things washing off, um, you know, over the years, this is a very durable setup. And of course we have our whole house water filter here as well. Another extra little feature that we almost always use. And then we have um, the extra macerator. So the Flowjet macerator is another option you can choose. These are also heated uh, exterior tanks for your gray and black water. Um, but the Flowjet system, as you can see, the hose is just a lot smaller, a lot more, uh, a lot more capacity, um, or I shouldn't say quicker capacity for dumping. It kind of sucks everything out for you. And then there's our extra uh, lithium ion battery 
set. So again, these are um, tied into a second 3000 watt inverter. So you've got two 3000 watt inverters giving you the accessibility to not only um, be track side, but to be track side with air conditioner without uh, being plugged into 50 amp. Um, so here's your chassis battery up front. And of course you've got little lights in this, but I just want to show off how nicely finished this is. Um, and then this is going to be your connect for your air hose. I'm not going to pull it off, but really, really nicely finished. Hopefully this door is open. If not, oh, whew, we're going to run around. Uh, the reason I wanted to show the cab from this side is uh, these chairs are fantastic. They're absolutely beautiful. Um, so you've got your chassis disconnect here. You've got your swivel here. You've got your heated seats. And then you have your uh, air ride. And then you've got power lumbar as well. And then all of your tilt features. And then you've got your tilt wheel release here, headlights. And then here in the center, as you can see, you've got an integrated trailer brake with a digital control. That little dial there on the left is for your trailer brake. Um, and the dash is just really second to none. We've done a really good job at integrating your navigation system. But as you can see, all of that is so cab facing. And then we've also opted for the extra uh, Cobra uh, walkie talkie. So you've got that's already been installed at the factory um, by, by Renegade. And then uh, one of the other nice features about this 12 speed is that this stock control, there's all the instructions on how to use it right here. Um, allows you to not have that flat face or flat panel that you'll find with a typical six-speed Allison transmission. Um, and this is not an automatic transmission. Um, this DT12 is going to be basically a clutchless manual transmission. So it has its own actuating clutch. So it's actually shifting gears, really allowing you to drive like a pro. So uh, it's not, you know, the Allison transmission is a true automatic transmission where this is actually truly a manual transmission with an automatic clutch. So a little different technology there. If you'd like to talk about applications and usages, you know, like I said, it's really important to understand not every coach is the same and they're all very, very modifiable to get you exactly what you want for getting on the road, getting out there, going camping. Um, so today's demo is, uh, again, on a really beautiful Renegade Classic. This is a custom order. It's something that you can have yourself very easily. If you're looking for the stock number, uh, just so you can keep it, if you jot this down, this is an easy way to pull this up again. It's 5N220579. And again, my name is Katie O'Neill. I'm coming to you live from Frederick, Colorado, uh, usually on Mondays, today's a special day. So happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Um, I hope that you'll really enjoy this video and let me know what I can do to get you out on the road camping. Uh, of course, you can reach me at 303-562-8659. Again, 303-562-8659. Thank you so much for spending some time with me over this holiday season. And let us know how we can get you on the road. Thank you so much for tuning in.